Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing my first shoe spring haul with Call It Spring. I've chosen my favorite pieces from their latest collection to show you how to style and why I love them. And I feel like the shoes I've chosen will definitely last you for years to come, which I know is really important for myself and from what I've heard from you guys, very important for you too. So let's get started. All right, so first off, we're gonna talk about this black booty here. It has a really nice little heel that isn't too high, but still elevates you a little bit. The shape of this boot is super elegant. It has a very narrow toe, which I like, especially if I'm gonna wear shorts this summer. It really elongates your leg. So it does have this little elastic bit here, so super comfy when you're walking and you're moving around. And of course it has this really fun stitching over here that's very Western boot inspired and I feel like would be super, super fun for spring and summer. And even fall, if you want to bring it into fall too, this would definitely work. So this is how I would style the black booties. I think styling it with a lot of denim is a good way to go because it does have that like Western vibe to it. So I've paired them with some high-waisted black kind of cut off shorts with my oversized white denim jacket, a white t-shirt. So yeah, this is a very easy look. I really like how these boots make my legs feel and look longer because of the pointed toe and the little bit of the heel does elevate me and make me look a little bit taller. So next up, I decided to show you a lighter boot. First of all, all the shoes I'm showing you today are gonna be vegan leather. So for those of you really concerned about that, they are vegan. So you are welcome to shop and peruse fearlessly. So next up, we'll talk about these beauties. These are also pretty Western inspired. The heel's a little bit more narrow than the black ones. We still have a very narrow and pointed toe. This one, instead of the elastic, we have the zipper here. It's very cute gold detailing. As you know, I love my gold. And everything else is pretty simple. It's very classic, very timeless. I can see myself bringing these boots in to fall as well. So this is really like an all season boot and I think that they'll be really, really cute in the spring. And so for these gray boots, I paired it with an oversized overshirt dress. This is like a khaki one because I love the safari feel and these are a bit of like a lighter boot and I found that the gray really popped when I added something that's like an off tone. So these are like cool, so like the so the boots are like a cool color and the top khaki is a warm tone. I think that it looks really cute together. And yeah, of course, another super easy casual outfit and very comfortable for spring, summer. And I also really love how the boots are like a tougher look and it really like dresses down and makes the dress a little bit cooler. So yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite ways to wear these boots. All right, so next up we have a pair of moccasins with a really, really cute toe detailing. I've been looking for a pair of loafer slash moccasins in this light chestnutty color for a while because I think that a color like this is perfect for someone's spring wardrobe. It's very easy to pair with jeans, very easy to pair with the whites and creams, and it just is super comfortable without being like a sneaker. So this is how I would style those moccasins slash loafers. They are like the perfect shade of brown which is why I have a matching sweater. And I paired it with some short alls that I will also be living in in spring and summer because they are so comfy. These are definitely more of like a casual shoe. So I would say like, if you are a pretty casual person and you're always looking for something easy to slip on, these would be the shoes for you. I think that they would also go really well with like the lighter colors that I tend to gravitate towards in the summer and spring. So yeah, these are super, super comfy. They are gripped on the bottom so you don't have to worry about slipping. And they also are like wide enough that I feel like if my feet expand in the summer, then they won't blister because I have a lot of trouble with like closed shoes in the summer because my feet tend to expand and I always get blisters back here. Because these ones do have that extra room, I think like they would be perfect for the issues I tend to have with closed toe shoes in the summer. Next up, we're moving into sandals and slides. You all know how much I love a good slide. This is a beautiful pair because it has like that crisscross action. I chose it in the black because you always need a good black sandal in your arsenal in the summer. I think that these are narrow enough and not too bulky to look too much like a house slipper. So for these black slides, I paired it with this dark jumpsuit. I think it looks really cute together and especially with like a cropped pair so you can really see the sandal. These ones are super comfy as I told you before. They kind of wrap around your foot a little bit further than the nude ones and the snake print ones. So if you're looking for 
kind of like something that's a little bit wider, I'd say. I think these are slightly wider than the rest of them. Then these ones would be the sandals for you. All right, next up are these really pretty nude slides slash sandals. I've already got a lot of questions about them because I've styled them a couple ways already. I really like the fact that this band is a different width from the outside to the inside. It really creates this elegant shape on your foot. Super comfy because they stop here. They're not too narrow in the front so your toes don't get cut off, but you also don't look like you're wearing like shower shoes. All right, so for the nude sandals, I decided to have a little bit more fun. I brought out this really cute pattern skirt that really goes well with the new tone of the sandals and then paired it with an off-white cream sweater just to keep things cozy up top and to bring up that neutral tone all the way up. As you know, these are one of my favorite sandals because of that really nice shape of the band and I think that it would really complement a lot of people's feet. So these ones are probably gonna be my most trendy shoes because they are snake print. I really like this shape. They remind me of like the Hermes sandal, but of course a lot more affordable. I think that these ones are very, very cute. The, as you can see, they start a little bit lower down, so they are a little bit of like a wider fit than the nude one that I just showed you. The snake print on this sandal is very, very luxe. Like I always look for a snake print that has like the mid tones too. Sometimes you can find snake prints that are too like high contrasting and they look in lack of a better word, cheap, but this one actually looks super luxe and super beautiful. All right, so for the snake print sandals, I paired it with an all white like pantsuit slash carpenter cargo pantsuit because it's a casual version of a blazer and trouser. I thought that it would really make the snake print stand out and I brought a gray shirt in the top just to bring up the gray tones that are in the print. These are super, super, super comfortable sandals and I can totally see myself just wearing these all the time because it's of course like on trend right now with all the snake print stuff that you see everywhere, but it's not like an obnoxious snake print. It's just very beautifully done. So yeah, these are definitely one of my favorite. So now we're moving into sandals out of slides. These ones are probably one of the most classic pieces you'll see in this haul. It has the beautiful black straps, it's vegan suede leather. This part of the shoe, I believe, makes it look super elegant and makes your foot look very, very narrow. So for these shoes, I decided to dress it up a little bit. They are a little bit more elegant than some of the other sandals and slides that you have seen. So they do have a little bit of a heel on it, so it is a little bit of like a more elegant shape too. That's why I think that these would be perfect for those occasions where like you can't really wear t-shirt and jeans or like distressed jeans, but you don't want to necessarily throw on a pair of heels and a, like a really dressy dress. That's why I paired it with a little bit of like a nicer top, a little bit more dramatic top than I would normally wear with these voluminous sleeves. And then these sandals really do bring the outfit together. So these are like a great kind of like pre-dressy sandal, I'd say. Next, we're gonna talk about these sandals that are like a beautiful caramel color. I love this color for spring, summer. These ones are a bit more casual than the black ones, as you can tell, because it has a completely flat bottom very grippy sole and a thicker front strap as well. So these ones would be perfect for, I guess, like a casual day out, walking around, maybe even on the beach because this isn't suede, so sand won't actually get caught in it. All right, so for these sandals, I have paired it with like a weekend look. This is a really easy go-to weekend look. I paired it with an overcoat that's made of fully linen, so it really drapes really nicely, looks very comfy added my Levi 501 skinnies to the mix and an easy tank top. These sandals kind of like don't even compare to slides. Slides are very easy to slip on and off, but if you're talking about like an all day shoe, if you will have like an all day adventure, but you still want to look cute, these would be the sandals for you because they do have the straps that hold in your foot. So you don't have to keep trying to catch your foot from sliding out of the slides. I would probably say these are the comfiest sandals out of the whole haul. So if you're looking for a really comfy pair that you can wear every day, like anywhere, then these ones would probably be it. And I think they look so cute with jeans. Last but not least are these sandals that I already got a lot of questions on too because I styled them with the H&M dress. I think that these are perfect for the summer, especially for summer weddings that tend to be 
outdoors and on grass because the thicker heel will prevent you from sinking into the ground. It has a beautiful front strap that you can tell is definitely more narrow than the two sandals that you just saw because these are like a little bit more of a dressier shoe. Plus the beauty of these sandals is that you have this lace detailing up here so you can really play with the shape of your foot. I tend to have a more narrow foot and so having this like customizability of like how narrow I can make this shoe and how much I can really hold my foot in is really important, especially if I'm wearing a heel. So these are a really, really good shoe to have. I think if you have like a lot of nicer events to go to in the summer. All right, so for these heels, I actually dressed it down. I thought that I'd show you this option as well because I think a lot of you probably know you can wear these heels with a cute sundress, with a floral dress, but I think that it looks so cute dressed down as well with this vintage oversized t-shirt dress and some biker shorts. I can really see myself wearing this to like a concert or kind of like a get together with friends in the summer where you just like wanna look cool, you know? Like I really love the contrast of something dressier with something like super casual and vintagey, and this is definitely one of my favorite looks. And that's a wrap. Thank you so much for watching this Call It Spring shoe haul with me. I hope that gave you some ideas on what kind of shoes you wanna get for spring and summer. Of course, if you have any questions, leave them down below. And I will be linking all the shoppable links for the shoes in the description box, so make sure to check that out. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe to my channel, and follow me on Instagram if you would like, and I will see you very soon.